Today we are at Illawarra Fly Treetop Adventures. At the first station I was going, oh no, but then I was reassuring myself that I had all the safety gear on and I was going to be fine. <laughs> that was fun. The instructors were really lovely. If you have any bouncing energy, this is where you get it at. They were really good at explaining things. We were really high up, it was about 16 metres. Yes! Woohoo! <laughs> My favourite part about going on the zip line would probably have to be when we went on the 106 metre zip line because it was just so much fun. It's longer than a football field. Mum and Dad did good, but not as good as the kids. We love the zip line. It's really good for families. 11, 11 out, out of 10. 10. Now we're doing the treetop walk. It's like a walkway high behind yeah, high the treetops. Feels a bit sh shaky. It's a little bit weird. It's very natural. There's heaps and heaps of trees everywhere. Climbing the tower goes on and on and on and it's 45 metres above the forest floor and 710 metres above the sea level. But it's worth it because when you get to the top the views are breathtaking. And we got to have a look at the whole of the Illawarra. And yeah, it's really good. If you get a chance to do the treetop walk, I definitely recommend on doing it. We're at Kaima Blowhole. The thing that's so cool about the Kaima Blowhole is when there's a big current, the waves crash into rocks and it comes up and it makes a big spout, like kind of like a whale. All of the tourists they go, Ooh. Wow! And it's kind of funny. The lighthouse can be seen from the highway, so when you're coming from Sydney down to Kayama, you can see it and you know that you've arrived in our beautiful town. When we come up to the Blowhole and Lighthouse, we love to go to Milk and Honey Cafe. They've got great coffee, snacks, meals and drinks. We've had a really fun day in Kayama. There's been so much to do for the family. Yeah, there's been zip lining for the kids, great coffee for mum and dad, and also great for all the family to see the blowhole and lighthouse at Blowhole Point.